Back in 1967, I had the good fortune of getting to be the girl singer on the Porter Wagoner show. Some of you might remember that. And when I started working with Porter, I told him I had come to Nashville to be my own star and to have my own group. But the money was so good, I told Porter I would stay for five years, and he agreed to that. Well, five years came, and I wanted to go, and the show was doing great, and Porter was having a real hard time with that, and he was stubborn. We used to fight like cats and dogs because we were both stubborn. But anyhow, I told him I wanted to go on, out on my own, so he was just having a fit about it, and we argued a lot, and I thought, he's never going to listen to me. He's not hearing a word I'm saying, so why don't you just go home, do what you do best, write a song. So I went home, wrote a song about it, came back the next day, and I said, Porter, just sit down. Let me sing you something, then you'll know how I feel. And I just want you to know that I will always love you. And that's what I call this song, and it goes like this. said you can go providing I can produce that record and he did and it was the biggest song I ever had 